heading up the creek right now to get to our fishing spot. We'll be there in a minute. Creek's pretty low. You can see it's real shallow right there. Grandpa's hooked up. Crickets never fail. <laughs> yep. Show him to the camera. Nice guy. Yep. All right, let's see if we can catch some more. Grandpa's got another one on. <laughs> Little guy. Yeah. But hey, it's a good sign. Yep. All right. We need to catch some more. Get me one on the board. Grandpa's got another one on. He's a good one. He's fighting. Yeah. Definitely a keeper. Yeah. He's pretty. He hooked you too. Not almost eye Oh yeah. Alright. Well, you're definitely catching them. Grandpa's got another one. Oh! That's a good one. You want to weigh him or? All right. Well, that's the first bass of the day. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Nice. Grow bigger. So you could grow bigger. Yeah. All right. Grandpa's got another one. Lighten them up. Well, had a bite. Yeah, it felt like it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Or it could have been the roots right there. Alright, well, let's try and catch some even more. Retying right now because just. Uh, hook set it on a fish and line popped. Must have been frayed. Just gonna go ahead and show y'all what I'm using. Mm -hmm. Not exactly sure the weight of this. Yeah, I did. Mm hmm. Not exactly sure what weight this is, but um, got this uh, pack right here. It's not really deep, you know. Kind of shallow. Mhm. Mm I'm just saying because the current. Yeah. And then using a uh, four aught EWG hook right here. Oh, you ain't talking to me. You talking to me. 
Um, and then I'll throw the same same worm I had on it. See if I can catch some on this. Grandpa hooked on to another one as I was about to put my worm on. Oh, he's a nice little guy. Here's what I'm tying on. Just some bubblegum trick worms. There we go. All rigged up. Grandpa got a little guy. We were just sitting there. His bobber, he wasn't even paying attention to his bobber. Just sitting in the water. Well, that shows they're definitely biting. Caught him right next to the boat. And he fell off. <laughs> All right. Grandpa hooked one over there. Another little guy. <laughs> All right. Well, that's one bite in here. Just caught this guy. He is a good old bass. Oh yeah. Barely hooked though. Jeez, come on now. Stop wiggling. Oh yeah. I'm about to get a weight on this thing. I'd, I'd probably say two. Uh-huh. He must have been really hungry. Rinse them off really quick. You did it. You did it. <laughs> Good guy. Nice one. Alright, let me get a weight on this guy. I'm going to throw him in the live well really quick at, while I get my scale out. Oh, you don't want me to wash him off? Oh, yeah. <laughs> That'd be great. Just don't please don't let go of him. Bear grip him. As hard as you can possibly grip. Okay. Lay that bad boy. See, now that's where you need to come home with me. Mm -hmm. So we can clean them. So you learn how to clean them. I'll show you how to, to lay them. 2.3. One pounds thirteen one pound thirteen ounces. He's close. You get a little fight, though. Oh yeah. I mean he he pulled. Yeah, I must have been fighting there. Nah. Mm. Will you take a couple pictures? Oh, no. Or here, I'll get pictures when we mm -hmm. dock it. Oh, er. get one Caught this guy. He was one pound, 13 ounces. So close to two. Fishing right in there. He hit it the first time. Spit it out, but um, Boing. threw right back in there. He took it that time. Grandpa thought it was a mud fish, but... Yep. Good deal. Alright. Grandpa's got one. He, he could be. Oh, yeah. Nice red breast. Very pretty. Yeah. Caught just about everything but a red breast. Well, there we go. Grandpa's got another one. 
<laughs> Getting a drink of water. Mm-hmm. I'm fishing right over there. Are you keeping him or throwing him back? That's a good eating really Yeah. Yeah. Let him grow bigger. Catch him again. Alright. Grandpa's got another one. Where's your, uh, um, the transducer? Like, where's it facing at? Like, where is it? Uh. Mm -hmm. right. Grandpa's hooked on a fish. Long cast, too. Yeah, fishing over there. Yeah. I thought he'd be bigger. Hmm. Well, we just had to hop out and push it, and now we're soaked. But at least we got a fish to make up for it. So let's hope we catch some more. Well, guys, line popped again. The fish tapped it twice, and then that was the third time I cast it out there. He hit it good, hook set, and then the line just popped again. So... Line might be old, I'm not really sure, but hopefully that won't happen again. Oh man. Oh, it's a little bass. <laughs> wow, I'm shocked he didn't get scared off because we basically ran over him. He was hooked good, right there in the gill plate. He wasn't coming off. Um, I'll try and get him off manually then, I'll see. Well, there he is, another little guy. Nice. Well, hopefully we can catch some more, but there we go. Just caught this little guy. Um, I think right in there, He or right in there. Um, he, it's real deep over there. How about the cypresses? He was actually like under the boat and then he bit it. But yeah, hopefully we can catch some more. That's two. Grandpa's got a, looks like a pretty good one. He's fighting real good. Yeah, he's not bad. He's pretty good. Yeah. Pretty fish, though. Yeah, they are. Somebody asked me, you gonna be caught all them fish? Y'all catch any rooster? <laughs> That's a dark male. Mm-hmm. Dark male. Yeah, man, we caught a couple of them. Hmm. Alright, Grandpa's hooked up on them. Oh, oh. Another fish is after you. <laughs> you see that? Yeah. I couldn't tell what it was, but I was about to say, I wonder if that was a bass trying to eat him. She got this little guy. Hit it right at the boat, really pretty.